Hallelujah, glory to God. This is Prophetic Intercession with Amel. You are most welcome. If this is the first time you're seeing me, the first time you're coming across my channel or deciding to click on my video, a special welcome to you. God bless you and thank you so much for stopping. I pray that God will use this channel to bless you, to help you grow in your spiritual journey. In the name of Jesus, amen. The Lord laid this prophetic word in my heart and I thought to share with us. You know, sometimes the people we so badly want to have them as our kingdom spouse are not necessarily the ones that God wants for us. Maybe somebody is talking to you and you feel like they are not um they are not somebody you love, they are not somebody that you want to marry them, but that is the person that will make you so happy. That is the person that will eventually give you fulfillment. That is the person that will make marriage worth living for you. It might not be your taste right now, but in the next three, four, five, ten years, you're going to be happy that you did marry that person. So what I pray for you is that you should not just walk by sight. We are people of faith. We do not walk by sight, but we walk by faith. What does your intuition tell you when that person is around you what does your listen to hear what your spirit is saying when that person is around you it might not be something somebody you love he might not possess the characteristics you love but they may just be the one that god has for you the one that will make you happy the one that will make marriage works for you if you just follow your your five senses if you just follow what you see and ignore what you feel what god is telling you you might be in error it is this person you did not expect this is a specific word for someone and I pray that it resonates with you greatly. The person that is your ordained kingdom spouse is the one you least expected. It is only with the eyes of the spirit that you're going to see this compatibility, that you're going to see that there is something in the future for you both. And it is my prayer that your eyes are open to that reality in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. God bless you and keep you. Cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace. Hallelujah.